Uh, uh, both guys are doing good, but will not play. Uh, Gilbert will go in. As far as James goes, I mean, what, what does he offer you? Obviously, you don't want to lose him. He's back now. What do you have in him, I guess? Uh, you know, uh, just another veteran goaltender, NHL goaltender that, uh, you know, I think we see with every team. Uh, when injuries come up, you need you need a goaltender. The plan is just to carry three right now? Uh, with no immediate. I mean, we're going to take this, really take it one day at a time. Um, you know, Oopi had, he's, he's had a good day today. Um, you know, I'm anticipating, you know, if not Saturday, he's ready for the next game. What have you uh, seen from Zach Benson that gives you confidence to, to put him on, on that line with Ryan McLeod and Alex Tuck tonight? Uh, just the way he's come back the second time, highly competitive. He's been able to hang on to pucks, uh. Uh, his game's been good. Uh, you know, I think that, you know, you look at uh, lines again, and our strength is if all four lines are producing and doing the right things, and I think he helps, you know, bring that quality to that, uh, to McLeod and, and Tuck. I know that Bell came back pretty quick from that injury. How is this time off kind of, has that helped him get closer? Uh, yeah, you know, I think initially I don't, you know, thought he was ready. I think every player thinks they're ready until they get in in the game situation. Um, I, I really liked his game, you know, through camp and, and what he did uh, leading up to when he got hurt. I thought, you know, post the games we put him back in, uh, not as much, but I think he was playing catch up and maybe, you know, I think sometimes the player pushes it to get back. He did get back sooner than everybody anticipated. Um, you know, he's strong in the puck, great skater. Uh, he's a guy that I think that can help our club, and uh, we get him back in and see what he looks like tonight. It's been a while for Henry, but is part of your decision simply if Henry goes in, you'd have two righties on your third pair, and Gilbert's a lefty? Yeah, that is part of it, and, and part of it is physicality. Uh, these guys are a heavy team. Um, I, I think what uh, Gibby has brought us is the ability to be physical. You know, I, I look at the tone that he set in the Ottawa game in the minutes he played and what that brought for our team. Um, it's about willingness to engage in those 50-50s and be physical. And uh, it's an aspect that I think has helped us win those, you know, win those tougher games like against the Ottawa team that tried to be physical. Um, you know, and you can go into uh, the Ranger game. There's been a lot uh, a lot of good that he's brought to the club. How do you want to see him strike that balance between the physicality and playing smart, not taking penalties? It, it, it's just, you know, something about staying on the right side of the puck, which he did a good job. I think, um, you know, he ended up tangled up in that uh, situation in, in the Calgary game. But, you know, really can't. Uh, when I looked at that breakout and how the puck kind of got away from him, it, Again, it's when you play lefties together and you're breaking out and you end up being that lefty on that side. If he was a righty, the play would have been a lot easier. Um, you know, and I think sometimes even in the ozone, when the play comes up the wall, it's a lot easier for us to shoot it. But now we got two lefties. We're picking a puck off the wall in our backhand. And, you know, so, you know, we're trying to build a, you know, a scheme where, you know, we get the puck off the wall a lot quicker. If we give it to our D, we're already off the wall, especially on that side of the ice. I know you've liked Krebs' effort. He's always back-checking. Um, it's just the details, you know, sometimes where he's not in the right spot when he's back-checking. As, as a coach, how do you work with a younger player and just on, you know, getting into the right spot? You yeah, know, the again, effort is there. Yeah, uh, some of it is just a, an understanding using video we'll use video well I mean a big part of our meeting was not only some of his plays but some of our other plays inside the game were um, containing versus running out of control and there's been a lot of good about his game for sure uh, his effort the, the goal he scored um, you know you, you just got to kind of strike a balance so sometimes his effort is what you really like and sometimes it's it, it takes him a little bit out of position. So it, um, I would rather have the guy that goes 100% and goes hard and, and physical than 
try to encourage the guy that doesn't want to get involved.